from performing all of her own stunts to having to buy back her stolen possessions. These are secrets fans don't know about Mariska Hargitay. The Emmy-winning actress is best known for her role as Olivia Benson on Law & Order Special Victims Unit. But did you know that Mariska's life story is just as intriguing as the cases she solves on the show? Mariska was born into Hollywood royalty as the daughter of actress and beauty symbol Jane Mansfield and the Hungarian-born former Mr. Universe Mickey Hargitay. Mariska's first and middle names are Hungarian and pay homage to Mary Magdalene. She was raised Catholic alongside her two older brothers, Miklos and Zoltan, as well as her three half-siblings, Jane Marie Mansfield, Antonio Kimber, and Tina Hargitay. However, things were far from rosy for Mariska's family. Her parents divorced in May 1963, but a judge later found their Mexican divorce invalid. They reconciled a few months before Mariska's birth in January 1964 but soon separated again. In August 1964, Mariska's mother successfully petitioned the court to make the Mexican divorce legal. However, a few weeks later, tragedy struck when Jane Mansfield was killed in a horrific automobile accident, leaving Mariska and her brothers to be raised by their father and his third wife, Ellen Ciano. Mariska was only three and a half years old when the accident occurred, in which she was left with a zigzag scar on one side of her head. Despite the challenges and heartbreak that Mariska faced in her childhood, she remained resilient and determined to forge her own path. She dislikes comparisons with her famous mother, saying, My dad was Mr. Universe, so it would be fun for me to be Miss Universe. However, Mariska has also been candid about the pain and loss that she has experienced due to her mother's death, stating that it has left a hole in my life that won't ever be filled. I will never get over it. I will always be a girl who lost her mom. Unfortunately, Mariska's father also passed away in 2006 from multiple myeloma in Los Angeles, California at the age of 80. Despite the tragic losses that she has endured, Mariska has become an inspiration to many for her strength, resilience, and dedication to her craft. She has continued to shine in the entertainment industry, captivating audiences with her captivating performances on Law & Order Special Victims Unit. Jane Mansfield may have been a Hollywood icon, but unfortunately, her passing in 1967 was marred by legal fees and expenses that ate away at her estate, leaving her children with little to inherit. According to Hargate, the situation only got worse when thieves broke into their home and stole her mother's jewelry and other belongings. It's a heartbreaking story that just goes to show how even the most glamorous lives can be brought down by tragedy. In the years that followed, various collectors ended up with pieces of Jane Mansfield's legacy, leaving Hargate with little to remember her mother by. She eventually had to buy back her own mother's charm bracelet just to have something to hold on to. It's a sad reminder that even in death, people can be stripped of their possessions and their legacies. Thankfully, Hargate has been able to keep her mother's memory alive in her own way. Growing up, Hargate was a jack of all trades. She was a cheerleader and was active in student government, athletics, and the theater program at her Catholic secondary school, Marymount High School. Her passion for acting led her to enroll at UCLA after graduating high school in 1982. And boy, did she make her mark quickly. In the same year, Hargate was crowned Miss Beverly Hills USA. Talk about hitting the ground running. By the time she was a freshman in college, Hargate had an agent and several small roles under her belt. But that's not all. Hargate was also a member of the prestigious Kappa Kappa Gamma sorority at the UCLA School of Theater, Film, and Television. She may have left college before completing her degree, but her talent and drive would take her far beyond the walls of academia. Never one to rest on her laurels, Hargate continued to hone her craft by attending the renowned Groundlings Theater and School in Los Angeles. It's safe to say that her time there was well spent, as her acting career continued to flourish and she eventually became a household name. Hargate's journey to Hollywood wasn't a smooth one. She encountered frequent comparisons to her mother and struggled to make a name for herself in the industry. However, she was eventually offered a role on the one-hour adventure drama series Downtown, which marked her first foray into television. From there, her career took off and she became one of the most beloved actresses on TV. Mariska Hargate is a total badass on screen and off. One of the ways she proves it is by doing her own stunts on Law & Order SVU. 
But one particular stunt back in 2009 led to an injury that could have been catastrophic. Hargitay suffered a collapsed lung after an awkward landing while filming a stunt. Initially, it was reported that the injury occurred offset, but it eventually manifested and caused Hargitay to fall to the ground and struggle to breathe. It was a scary moment, but Hargitay's resilience and strength kicked in, and she underwent multiple surgeries to repair the lung tissue damaged by the stunt. That's dedication to the craft. But Hargitay is not just an actress. She's also an advocate for victims of sexual assault, domestic violence, and child abuse. In 2004, she founded the Joyful Heart Foundation, an organization that provides support to survivors of these heinous crimes. Hargitay was inspired to create the foundation after a profound encounter with a pod of dolphins while swimming off the coast of Hawaii at the age of 15. She wanted to share that experience with others and help them heal from the trauma of abuse. Through the Joyful Heart Foundation, Hargitay has helped thousands of women and children by sending them on therapeutic programs in New York, Los Angeles, and Hawaii. These programs combine yoga, meditation, massage, journaling, and swimming with dolphins, helping survivors reclaim their lives and live them with a renewed sense of possibility and hope. Hargate has received countless letters from survivors who felt a connection to her character on Law & Order SVU. These survivors often disclose their personal stories of abuse for the very first time, and Hargate is dedicated to helping them heal and move forward. She believes that shame belongs to the perpetrators and that survivors should never have to suffer in silence. Mariska Hargate is not only an incredibly talented actress, but also a compassionate and devoted advocate. She has used her platform to create a positive impact on the world and has inspired countless people to find hope and healing in the face of trauma. But what about her dating life, you ask? The stunning actress has had quite a romantic journey. On August 28, 2004, in Santa Barbara, California, Hargate married Peter Herman, an actor whom she met on the set of Law & Order SVU. How romantic is that? And to top it off, he plays the reoccurring role of defense attorney Trevor Langan. Talk about a perfect match made in Hollywood heaven! On June 28, 2006, Hargate gave birth to their son, August, via an emergency C-section. Fast forward to April 2011, and the couple adopted a baby girl, Amaya, and attended her birth. And the love and joy just kept growing from there. In October 2011, they adopted a son, Andrew, who had been born earlier that year. Quite an adorable family indeed! It's enough to melt even the coldest of hearts. But that's not all. Hargate's talents don't just stop at acting. This multi-talented woman can speak five languages, people! You heard it right. English, French, Hungarian, Spanish, and Italian. Who needs a translator when you have Mariska Hargate in your corner? And did you know that she's the godmother to Sophia, one of her co-star Christopher Maloney's children? Talk about keeping it in the Law & Order family. But what about her personal beliefs, you might ask? Well, in a 2010 interview with Good Housekeeping, Hargate stated that she considers herself a Christian. Between her acting skills, multilingual talents, and adorable family, Mariska Hargate is one celebrity that we just can't get enough of.